And it's a little more messy to the north and west. In fact, a lot more. But we don't want you to let your guard down in and around the Tulsa metro. There will be slick spots. The temperature keeps dropping, so any water now that's on the roadway is, is freezing up quickly. At the same time, we have some other uh, physical properties helping us out a little bit. The winds are picking up. That will also have a drying effect in some spots. And to the north and west, where it's totally different, the wind picking up is not a good thing because with ice and trees and on power lines, we may start to see a few more uh, minor power outages. This is Tim Crown. He's near Caney, Kansas. And again, sleet covered, ice covered roadways across far northern Oklahoma to southern Kansas. That's where the ice storm warning technically is still underway, even though the falling precipitation is over. Uh, Von Castor has been all over this morning. He's now back down into the metro. He's going to check out some of those roadway conditions close on the Broken Air Expressway and uh, his brother Val and uh, sister law Amy, they're west of Stillwater on I-35 north of Oklahoma City. So just west of Stillwater, close to Mohol. And you can see a jackknife truck there on I-35 because of sleet and ice covered roadways. So we still have a travel advisory technically underway across eastern Oklahoma and the ice storm warnings to the north. Even though the falling precipitation is over, this is a good call from our friends at the Weather Service. Keep everybody aware this morning, watching the roadways, the slick spots, and even though the precipitation now is out of the state, basically, still around Poto, the cloud deck behind it with the cold weather, there will probably be some snow flurries on occasion that will fall down, but that will not be anything. 25 in Tulsa right now, the wind chill is at 10. 27 in Bixby, these numbers keep dropping. Boy, check out Pawnee, that's a temperature at 18. 32 in Tahlequah, it's 35 in the Poto area. Wind chills now, single digits here near Stillwater, Pawnee, Pawhuska. 15 in Bartlesville, it's 19 in Muskogee, and a wind chill in McAllister, 24. So in the metro, we're going to be in the lower 20s in the next several hours. Blustery winds, cloud cover, maybe even a flurry. And then sometime around the 1 to 2 o'clock hour, the clouds should thin out. We have a little sunshine planned and highs into the mid and upper 20s. The northwest winds are going to be strong. So high temperatures, well, I should back up. Highs were actually reached early, early this morning. Afternoon temperatures will be in the lower to mid 20s here and a few 30s down to the south.